National Police Week in the city of Waco is recognizing fallen law enforcement heroes. That's right. Fox 44's Renaka G attended the ceremony to participate in honoring former and current officers who serve our community. Every year in May, a police officer memorial is held to salute the heroes who sacrificed their lives in the line of duty. The Waco Police Department, alongside multiple Central Texas agencies, gathered at the Peace Officer Memorial Plaza in Indian Spring Parks to pay their respects to fallen officers. The ceremony commenced with the presentation of the Law Enforcement Honor Guard, followed by the national anthem performed by the University High School Band, leading up to Mayor Dylan Meek proclaiming May 18th a day of remembrance for fallen officers in Waco. Ceremonial guest speaker Lieutenant Gary Miles shares why his and others like him services matter. We must do everything that we can do because we need police officers, peace officers to serve our communities, to serve our counties, serving our states around the nation. So uh, that's the significance of what it means to me to be able to still be connected in the community. Leaders at today's service roll called the names of members who serve in the Waco and surrounding areas starting from the years of 1870s all the way up until 2021. Family members in attendance laid roses in front of the memorial monument as they heard the names of their loved ones called. Waco PD's Chief Cheryl Victorian says this week is a special time for law enforcement officers and their families. The time that we take to honor those who have lost their lives in the line of duty who have made the, paid the ultimate sacrifice, and a time also to celebrate the families, to let them know that I don't care how long ago uh, their family member lost their loved one, that, that we're, they'll never be forgotten. Those who work in the law enforcement profession are always encouraging members of the community to say hello and to not be afraid to get to know them. In Waco, Renaco G, Fox 44 News. Well, it's a pretty nice